Oh, that's good news. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Wolf Quest, where Maple has finally recovered from her injury and probably will get another one, if we're being perfectly honest. Also, Stream is back up to 100% health. The pups are a little bit hungry, but Brooke has made it to 13, so we're probably going to leave for the rendezvous site fairly soon here. Uh, also, I am playing Wolf Quest with a cat in my lap, so we're going to see how this goes. Wonderful! Great, you love to see it. Guys, go in the den now, please. Now, please. Oh, there goes Evie. Evie is uh Evie is leaving. Okay. Hey, 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 go, 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 go. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, no, 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 no. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. I'm not I'm not I need to be running. I need to be running and I'm not running. Why am I not running? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, Hope has bitten. Please go back in the den, pups. Oh, I need to get out of there. I need to get out of there. Martin's going in the den. Martin's going in the den. All right, uh, Seashell and Turtle are not in the den. <laughs> uh, this is not great. Nope. Get out. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of damage. No, 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 no. Excuse me? Nope. Why is it in the water? What the frick? <laughs> Excuse me? Why did it just jump in the lake with her? Oh my goodness, Seashell, are you okay? You're not supposed to live up to your name in that respect. Holy cow. That commotion was a little too much for Evie, too. She she left. She's gonna stand here and yell at me. Um, Miraculously, no one took an injury. Seashell's health is very low, though. Holy cow. Um, Why don't you go in the den? We're gonna leave these guys, you know what, I'm gonna try to leave these guys at this den. Okay, turtle, we, we need to go in the den, goodness. Um, we need to get food, there is a carcass. How is our territory, oh, okay. That's not great. That's not great, not gonna lie. All right, we're gonna first order of business, get some food. Hope, come here, wait, Hope, come here. Hope, come here, Hope, hold on. Hold on, he's leaving on his own. He's leaving on his own. We need to go get food. This way to food. Okay, we have got a fox on the carcass and coyotes near it. Hope, goodness, why? I told you to come with us. He came back to the den and he just stayed. All right, is he at least coming this way now? Did he hear that? You guys, on the other hand, can go. No. I'm gonna try not to get an injury from the coyotes because that would just be my luck. Is he actually on his way? He is, good. All right, y'all can get out of here. Y'all can go. Hey, yeah, 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 you're not, no. You're not doing this. We're not doing this. You can go, this is my carcass. I killed it, I keeping it. Get, do not make me start biting. I'm gonna start biting. No, 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 you get out of here. You get out of here, you stubborn little heckers. You can leave. No, you don't. Get out. Get out. Leave. Be gone. Hope I could use some reinforcements. These fools don't want to go. These fools don't want to go. You're going to get your butts handed to you if you ain't careful. Yeah, look at them. Okay, you better run. Yeah, there we go. Finally. About dang time. There's not a whole lot of food left, so I'm probably going to let Hope have most of this because uh, we'll send him back to look after the pups. Although... Honestly, well, the pups do need food. The pups do need food. Well, the pups don't need food that badly. We're going to need reinforcement dealing with this heckery. Look at them cutting right through our territory. You can see where they're going. All right. We got to deal with these heckers again. They were here before. We chased them out and they came back. So we're going to try to chase them out again because they can't be doing this. We're gonna go and claim over this. They're, they apparently put the scent post way on the other side of the hex too, just to uh, just to be a nuisance. So we're we're gonna go over there and claim it because yeah, no, you don't get to do this. You do not get to do this. Here we go. They probably are down in our territory as we speak too. Well, um, oh yeah, they're they're. I see exactly where they're pro they probably are. They're probably right there. Okay, we're gonna go to the edge of the hex. We're gonna put the scent post back so we're sensible, and then we're gonna go over into that other hex and make sure they ain't fooling around there. You know, there is a tiny patch of land here, so our scent post over there. Can we pee right here? No. Nope, we would There's just like a tiny spot that if we're incredibly careful, we might be able, oh my goodness, we can do it. We can move the scent post somewhere more convenient because this is right by our rendezvous site. As soon as uh, Maple stops scratching, this is the rendezvous site right over here. Stop scratching, goodness. 
the flea load is going up um definitely going up it's up to 60 percent now and irritating i'm just inclined to just try and weather it honestly because it's not gonna be that long of a wait i don't think and it's actually a fairly straight shot to this rendezvous site if we don't go up the uh, other den area over there. So, you know, it might be worth uh, waiting it out if we can. We don't normally have the option of doing that, and I think we're going to try to this time. But we mark the territory. It's looking a lot better now. I don't care as much about this because we're leaving soon. So as long as we get out of here in a reasonable amount of time, I think we'll be all right. We might get a stranger wolf, but I think we get a stranger wolf attack normally anyway. Like, it's just, it's been too long. I think we're going to get one anyway. So I think we're just going to lay low for a little bit, try to heal up, try to play with the puffs, let Seashell heal up because goodness, she took a beating from that bear. Uh, and then hopefully by about the time that we're recovering, it'll be about time to leave for the rendezvous site. And we'll also start having the calves and fawns show up, which is going to make everything a lot easier. Oh, okay. We've got the calves and fawns now, it looks like. It's also dawn, the pups are hungry again, but they're almost up to 14 pounds, uh, with seashell being the heaviest at 15, and thankfully now at full health. Um, we're gonna move these guys back in the den. Yeah, gotcha, okay. Um, where are these wolves? Are they that way? No. Well, they might be. Oh goodness, there's a puppy pile up at the den, at the den entrance. I see him over here. I see him over here. No, you don't. No, you don't. Don't you tilt your head at me. You know what full well what this means. It means I'm about to bite you. It means I'm about to bite you if you don't get. Yeah, you get. Go on. Get out. Get out. Go. She's swimming. Okay, Junction Butte. Yep. Yep. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and... We're gonna need to do another hunt. Well, no, we're not gonna need to do another hunt. We can find uh, we can find the calves and fawns now. Um, we're mostly just we're almost completely healed up here. We're mostly just gonna do some territory boosting and then go looking for some uh, some calves and fawns. I think we'll see. I think hope staying back. Yeah, I'm fine with that because I can bring him back food more easily now as I can for the pups. Oh, we found our first baby. Time for a snack. Let's go ahead and uh, eat. We'll eat this one and we'll bring it. Whatever we find next, we'll bring back to the pups and to Hope because Maple's pretty hungry too. Uh, I think it's going to be for the best if she gets the chance to eat here. All right, we're going to be on the lookout for either an elk calf or a moose calf. Moose calf is risky. Oh, is this the tracks here? Oh, this might be the bull elk or the bull moose that was across the stream here. Yeah, it looks like this is going to go into the river, possibly. Well, maybe not. I, I did just pass a bull moose, so it could be. But yeah, a moose hunt would be risky. It would give us a lot of food, but it would be risky. But it would probably feed both Hope and the pups. So that's what would make that beneficial. However, we really have to be on our game with it. Because if we get whacked, that's going to hurt a lot. Because we're on accurate Iron Wolf. And that's going to be bad. Also, Maple does not much have health. We will take this hair, however. I'm not going to ever say no to a hair when we're hungry. Oh. All right. Everybody's at at least 14 pounds. So it's going to be time to leave soon. We already know what rendezvous we're going to. So we don't really have to bother looking for it. I'm just going to bother with tracking this moose, I say as I proceed to completely lose the trail. Okay, where did it go? It turns, it's, it veered this way. Sometimes it's hard to see in the grass, it can just disappear out from under your nose. Well, that's a bull moose anyway, so not going to do us much, uh, much good. There's really not been a lot of calves and fawns yet, we've only found the one fawn. And all I can smell is elk herds, which is a little bit less than helpful right now. We don't want to hunt them when they're at full health. That's not generally a very helpful thing to do. I just want to find something that I can bring back for the for the others, for, for Hope and the babies. But we're not having the best of luck with it. Oh, maybe I spoke too soon, though. Where is this mama? Might have to do some sniffing around. Oh, right there. Mule deer. You know what? A mule deer's better than nothing. I'll take it. There we go. We got the baby. Let's bring it back for our babies. Uh, it might not be enough for Hope. We might still have to find some food for him and bring it back, but it's going to be better than nothing. So, interesting development. Um, Hope, I guess, just left 
the pup's chilling out here while he went in the den with Turtle. <laughs> um, yeah, bud, I wouldn't recommend that, honestly. Like, that doesn't seem very safe. Uh, well, why don't you stay with them a little bit more? No, 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 no. Stay back with the pups. Go back with the pups. Go back with the pups. We're, we're gonna go find some food for you now, too. Is that... That's just... Oh. That's an elk herd really close. Goodness. Aha. Here we go. So somewhere around here. Not the hair. But I just heard the music start up. So somewhere around here, there is a mother. Please let me eat. There we go. This darn scratching. It is getting annoying, but it's not worth leaving now for, I think. Okay. Where exactly is this mother? I don't even see her. She might be laying down. Oh, is that? Yep, another mule deer. Okay. Wish we could find more elk. They have bigger babies, but this is fine. There we go. We got it. All right, let's bring this back. How much did the others get to eat? Oh, they got to eat quite a lot. Okay. So they're pretty much full. If we bring this over near Hope and then call him over, it'll probably be fine. He'll probably come eat it. So that shouldn't be too difficult. All right, Hope is up to 100. The pups are all doing fairly well. They're still munching too. They still got a little bit of this one left. Uh, but I think we're gonna go ahead and take a nap because they're very tired, we're very tired, and it's almost time to leave for the rendezvous site. So we will get some rest and I think we are gonna go ahead and leave this off here for today because it is getting to be about that time again. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys next time. But until then, this is Jay, over and out.